from the KLFY News 10 Sports Center. We are Acadiana's local sports leader. Hello, Acadiana. Happy New Year. The UL women's basketball team is the defending Sun Belt regular season champion. In the quest to repeat, the Cajuns fell in the conference opener to UT Arlington Thursday. But Gary Broadhead's squad had the chance to bounce back today at the Cajun Dome against Texas State. It was a 29 27 game in favor of the Bobcats at halftime. And it would still be a back and forth game most of the third quarter. Ty Doucette uses a glass there, gets two, her only two points of the game. The Cajuns shot 60% from the field in the third and fourth quarters. Destiny Rice with the assist to Tamara Johnson knocks down the jumper. The LCA product had 25 points on the day, a career high as the Cajuns lead by three. Lene Wheaton, though, put up a game high 26 points. Those are just two of them. She's another freshman that stepped up big for UL today. A career high performance as the Cajuns take a five point lead. Texas State creeps back there. That triple from Gabby Standifer. It's a one point Bobcats lead, but the Cajuns pull away in the end. Mayme Holman, who had 16 points to Johnson, they are a three for her. One of her two trays on the day, and the Cajuns lead by as much as 11 in the fourth. And the Sun Belt, number w Sun Belt win number one is secured. UL beats Texas State 78 to 72. The first half, it was just not falling, and then we just had to start shooting our shot because we were just forcing at first. And then the second half, we came out, they were falling, so just keep taking your shot. I thought Tamara did a good job of finding her shot, and Lene is just a great jump shooter. You know, that's kind of what we recruit is, you know, not just a three-point shooter. We want that jump shooter that can drive and shoot the shot from the free throw line or maybe the short corner and stuff, and that's kind of what she is. And, I mean, she showed up today, and she's got such shifty moves. I mean, her body is, I mean, she's real tough to guard, you know, and that's, uh, she showed up today, and I think if we can continue to get consistency there, we're going to see some growth. 